Hello my friends, the long wait is finally over. Destiny has been revealed to the world. What did I think of Bungie's Vidoc? Well, I thought it was 4 minutes and 19 seconds of unadulterated fucking joy. I think Destiny's 10 year mega franchise is the purest form of escapist entertainment a gamer could possibly wish for. In short, it blew my fucking mind. Destiny is a universe we'll be exploring together, you and I, for the next decade. Holy shit balls! A decade of sharing war stories and battle scars. Now, my huge video blowout of Bungie's Vidoc will go live tomorrow. In the meantime, I thought I'd make this video about Destiny's two new vehicles to tide you over until then, you lucky bastards. First up, we have this gorgeous concept art for the Pike Landspeeder. Now many people are calling it Destiny's equivalent of Halo's Ghost, although we've not actually seen it in action so there's no way of knowing how it will handle or when you will actually get to use one. Do you need to buy one of these things, will you steal them from another alien race, or perhaps discover them on a raid mission in one of Destiny's many outworld locations. We just don't know, but I'm sure we'll have a hell of a lot of fun finding out. Now remember guys, vehicles will be fully customizable and will surely play an important role in exploring Destiny's universe. Now this Pike looks like it's a single passenger vehicle, as you can see there's only one guy on it. But who knows, maybe an extra passenger can sit on the back of it too because there's also a little bit of a space behind him. Notice also the guns on the front of this thing. Um, so expect vehicular combat just like you do in Halo. Now guys, this Pike Landspeeder kind of reminds me of two vehicles from Star Wars. Uh, specifically, this vehicle, this bike speeder and this land speeder what do you think guys let's compare all three together now i definitely think that there's like a star wars vibe about this pike land speeder and i wouldn't be surprised if um these two vehicles were an inspiration for it leave a comment let me know what you think now guys next up we have a screenshot taken from bungie's vidoc documentary. It's only referred to as Destiny's ship. Now, Destiny's game will take place in our solar system. We'll be able to explore the moon, Mars, Venus, Jupiter, and the rings of Saturn. And of course, you'll need some kind of spacecraft to travel to these places. Bungie's Vidog did show brief glimpses of this ship in flight, but we still don't know whether we'll actually get to pilot one of these things like in Star Fox, or simply hop in one like Mass Effect, wait for a cutscene, and then get out at the desired destination. Personally, I really hope we get to actually pilot them. Now guys, check this out. I discovered this poster on Bungie's official online store. As you can see, it's referred to only as Destiny's Ship. It costs $29.99, which is fairly steep if you ask me for a poster, but it is a gorgeous looking poster. Now, let's have a look at this in close-up. If we have a look at the bottom portion of this poster in close-up, as you can see here, it says, The front it awaits. Be brave. Unfortunately, we can't see uh, what this writing says. It's, it's too small, and uh, we can't actually zoom in on this poster, so we don't know what that says, but the whole the frontier awaits be brave little phrase at the bottom suggests that we will definitely be using this uh, in the game. So guys, let's um, compare this thing to the still shot that we saw earlier in Bungie's Vidal. They definitely appear to be the same vehicle and suggest that yes, we will definitely be using it in Bungie's Destiny. In what capacity exactly, we don't know. So guys, what do you think of these vehicles? Personally, I can't wait to start exploring Destiny in these things. Guys, thumbs up if you enjoyed the video, and don't forget to subscribe for all the latest Destiny news. And uh, let me remind you guys that I also have a Destiny fans Facebook page. I've left a link to it in the description box below. All you have to do is click the link and click like. There are now 151 Destiny fans, and I post concept art. I'll be speaking about these tomorrow, actually, in my 
um, other Destiny video. I've posted the question, which version of Destiny will you purchase, Xbox 360 or PlayStation 3? And every single person that's answered has said 360. It's a unanimous vote. Everyone's going for the 360 version. Um, I'm sure there'll be some PS3 owners too. So guys, click the link in the description box. Give this Destiny fans a like. And as always, guys, thanks for watching, you beautiful bastards. <laughs>